A really nice day coming our way with that bright sunshine. It's going to stick around for the entire afternoon. Clear skies into evening highs today approaching the upper 70s. Maybe a few spots touching 80 degrees winds in northeast 5 to 10 miles per hour right now at the airport. Low 60 61 degrees, low dew points, low humidity, light winds from the northeast 5 miles per hour, 49 degrees in Bogalusa up to 50 now in Hammond from 48 degrees, 50 degrees in Slidell. So clearly a little cooler north of the lake 50s and 60s on the south shore 53 right now for Gulfport. The weekend looking good, but a little bit warmer. High temperatures right around the low 80s for the weekend with the sunny cloud mix Saturday and then Sunday a 20% chance of showers with mainly cloudy skies. This all happening ahead of our next strong cold front. We do have a front close by its week. Not a lot of showers associated with that. That will push through later on tonight. So it keeps us low humidity throughout the night and clear skies into early Saturday morning. Our next strong front though coming in from the west coast. That one will come barreling through the central part of the country and that will bring us some cooler air next week. Today sunny skies continue. You'll notice overnight early morning if you have some uh, maybe some errands to run Saturday more clouds out there but still a sun cloud mix throughout the day on Saturday Sunday we get increasing cloud cover chance for spotty showers starting mid to late morning on the North Shore maybe some lingering stray areas of drizzle lasting through uh, or late Sunday morning early afternoon on the South Shore but not much rainfall in the forecast and then by Monday starting early we're drying out clearing out and of course cooler air shifting in here is post tropical system Ada off the coast of the Carolina the system will continue to pull away from the southeastern coast, the mid-Atlantic states. Still some increased swell lingering there. Theta in the eastern Atlantic waters, no threat to land, thankfully. It's this disturbance here that will be our next to fire up. That next name on the list is Iota, and we could see Iota developing either today, tonight, possibly into Saturday more organization with these showers and storms over Central America, which will be tracking to the west and towards Central America. Forecast models do indicate that this system uh, will likely become a hurricane as it makes its way towards Central America into early next week. Today looking good, 74 to 80, so a really nice end to the week. Our next seven days looking good too, 50s and 60s tonight. Here's that forecast, something for everyone, including some gumbo weather next week as M morning lows return to the 40s and 50s highs next week right around 70 degrees.